chapter 28 of the sacraments. Sacraments are holy signs and seals of the covenant of grace immediately instituted by Christ to represent him and his benefits and to confirm our interest in him and solemnly to engage us to the service of God in Christ according to his word. Paragraph 2. There is in every sacrament a spiritual relation or sacramental union between the sign and the thing signified, whence it comes to pass that the names and effects of the one are attributed to the other. Paragraph 3. The grace which is exhibited in or by the sacraments rightly used is not conferred by any power in them, neither does the efficacy of a sacrament depend upon the piety of or intention of him that does administer it, but upon the work of the Spirit and the word of institution, which contains, together with a precept authorizing the use thereof, a promise of benefit to worthy receivers. Paragraph 4. There be only two sacraments ordained by Christ our Lord in the gospel, that is to say, baptism and the Lord's Supper neither of which may be dispensed by any, but by a minister of the word lawfully called. Paragraph 5. The sacraments of the Old Testament, in regard to the spiritual things thereby signified and exhibited, were for substance the same with those of the new. The end of chapter 28.